Tonight, Team 10 is continuing to investigate the case of three San Diego police officers suspected of firing their weapons outside a mall restaurant in Escondido. Tonight, we pressed Mayor Bob Filner about what's been done to further the investigation, and his answer surprised even us. Good evening. I'm Steve Atkinson. And I'm Virginia Cha, in for Kimberly Hunt. Team 10 investigator Itika Malanis is at police headquarters with why Mayor Filner says the witness who heard those gunshots got it all wrong. Now, police aren't telling us if the officers guns were tested or if their hands were tested for gunpowder residue. All police are saying at this point is that there is no evidence to suggest that a crime was committed. March 6th, sometime around midnight, someone at the North County Fair Mall heard gunshots near the on the border restaurant and called 911. I have a few RPs advising that there were two males walking in the area. 11 sixes were heard. When Escondido police arrived, they found three off-duty San Diego police officers. They had guns, but denied firing them. Team 10 sources say some rounds were missing from their magazines, but another officer told us law enforcement agencies do not have a system in place that tracks officers' ammunition. When we followed up with SDPD, Lieutenant Andrew Brown told Team 10 there is no evidence to suggest the officers fired their guns. It is being reviewed internally. It's not something that will just go away. We caught up with Mayor Bob Filner around noon Tuesday to ask him about this incident, but he hadn't been briefed yet. Then around 630, we asked him about it again, and he said the witness got it all wrong. I think that was misinformation, but uh, the final report has not been made yet. So the first indication was that they did, had not fired their weapons. Uh, their weapons were examined. There was no evidence of them firing as far as I know now. Filner said he is confident the police department's internal review will flush out the facts of what happened. Itika Milanis, 10 News. Escondido police did not pursue charges because they didn't find any bullets or evidence of damage. The three officers were turned over to their own department to determine if any policies were broken.